California Love, right? How did Tupac get on that record, man? Because I always heard this rumor, and I'm sure you heard it before too, that Dre, he really didn't want Tupac on that record, but Suge, he made him put him on there. Is there any truth to that? Oh, <clears throat> Doc Dre been had that beat. He had that beat for a while. Shit, Doc Dre even told me once, you like this beat, Corrupt? Yeah, I'm gonna see how you sound on it. And I was like, ugh, I thought this was finna be my, this was gonna be my chance. You know what I'm saying? And then Tupac came on. And then uh, Dr. Dr. we was all, you know, when the way we do it at Death Row is whose ever turn it is, everybody contributes. So, you know, your project freezes, everybody contributes towards the project that's at hand. So Dr. Dre gave Tupac his, it, it, Dr. Dre was working on that record for a while before Tupac came home and then when Tupac came home, I looked at that beat like Dr. Dre's heart. He, that was like one of his, like, oh, he has such a plan for it that he was trying to f figure out what am I gonna do with this beat? Cause it was so gruesome and banging, but it was fun. Tupac came home. So I looked at, when he gave him California Love, I looked at like Dr. Dre gave Tupac his heart. That's what that beat was like to me when it came to Dr. Dre, cause I used to go in there while he was working on it. He, it, it was, that was his baby. That California Love beat was Dr. Dre's baby. You know what I'm saying? So that rumor a lot then. So Dre, he had no issue giving that to Tupac. Hell no, yeah, he gave it to, he gave it to Pac. They gave him his heart. Like, okay, I got something for you. I'm gonna give you my number one. I only need to give you one, okay? I'm gonna give you my number one. Bam, 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 bam. That motherfucker played, it was like, damn! You know what I'm saying? And you know, so, you know, that was basically it. Whether Dr. Dre first said, you know what? Wait, hold on, I got plans for this beat or not. I don't know about that. I know that Dr. Dre was like, I'm, all I gotta do is give one, and this is gonna be the key to the whole project. Bang! Tupac lost his mind. Hey, yo, you know another song that Dre did for Tupac, man, that nobody never talk about, man, and that shit go hard, man? Can't See Me. You can't see me. You motherfucking right. And you wanna hear a twist? That was originally a Dog Pound record. Me and Daz. You know, Pac came home, it was his turn. So we all gave that to Tupac took our lyrics off of it. Daz got the original, me and Daz, and, and George Clinton. Yup, and then uh, uh, Tupac came home. It's his turn, it's not our turn. Our turn is over, we made our mark, two million sold, we in the game, it's Tupac's turn. Bam, so Dad started loading him up, starting with ambitions of a rider. And then Dr. Dre was like, you like this? He, and he played You Can't See Me, and boom, Tupac said, hell yeah. Because Dr. Dre had it with the instrumental. I mean, he had the one without our vocals on there. So it was a rap. 